Hey guys, today's workout is booty time. I'm really excited to bring you this workout. We're gonna be doing a whole lot of legs, a whole lot of booty. So we're gonna start standing. Now, you need sliders, but you don't really need them. If you have sliders at home, you're gonna use those. If you don't have sliders, easy. Put socks on and just be on a slippery surface like tiles or um, timber, just not carpet. So you can put socks on, your socks will slide, you could put a towel underneath your feet, like a little tea towel or a handkerchief or anything like that. Anything kind of slippery, um, which is really going to help us build that booty burn. So let's get started. All right, we're starting with our feet together and we are just stepping side to side. So we step one foot to the opposite edge of our mat. We reach that opposite arm down, rotate the spine slightly and then press through the heel to come back to center. Inhale, we go down. Exhale, we go back to center. About another 10 seconds here, warming up through the inner thighs, through the hips and the glutes. Last couple more here, and then we are gonna go into some sumo squats. So now let's step our toes nice and wide. Inhaling down into the sumo, exhale, we stand, squeeze the butt. Make sure those knees press nice and open. Drive through those heels to lift. Let's go for a couple more seconds here. We're gonna add a rotation, oblique crunch. Exhale, as we stand, rotate towards the opposite knee. Hands are in prayer, twisting side to side. Exhale, we twist, inhale, we lower. We've got another 10 seconds here, really warming up through the waist. Now let's squeeze our butt as we stand up. We've got squat pulses next. Let's go down, down. Down, nice and low in that sumo, knees nice and wide, press through those heels. Couple more, we're gonna go down to a little hip stretch, breathe, should be feeling warm. Down into that hip stretch, elbows are into the insides of the knees. You can choose to rock side to side, I think this feels nice to wiggle side to side, or you can choose to stay still. I'm pretty impatient, so I always like to move when I'm stretching. <laughs> breathe, opening through those hips. All right, let's grab our sliders. So if you have a slider, they're two-sided, so make sure you know which side goes down. For my slider, it's the black side that goes down on timber floor. We've got our left foot forward, our right toes back on the slider. Tuck the pelvis under, roll the shoulders down and back. We inhale, slide out to a lunge. Exhale, stand, squeeze the butt. So we're driving through this left heel as we rise. Inhale, we lower. Exhale, we rise, squeeze the glutes to the top. You can choose to reach your arms forward or you can choose to keep them on your hips. Now I recommend looking at something on the horizon to help your balance. Pressing through that heel to rise. Couple more here. We're going to add three pulses at the bottom. Let's add those pulses. Three, two, one, and rise. Three, two, one, and rise. We're going to reach our arms forward. Three, two, one, arms back. Arms forward, three, two, one, arms back. Arms forward, three, two, one, arms back. Make sure we're squeezing our butt to stand. Keep going here, three pulses at the bottom. Squeeze your butt to rise, bracing those abs. Good, all right, keep going. Down for three, two, one. Press, we hold this one down, pulse 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, squeeze about 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, rise up. All right, we've got an arrow lunge now, so the back leg's going to stay straight. We inhale, tip forward, reach the crown of the head high. Exhale, we rise, squeeze that butt. Whoop. Inhale, we tip. Exhale, we rise. So now the back leg is staying pretty straight. We're really loading up through this front glute. We add the arms. So as we lunge, we reach our arms forward up at a diagonal. As we rise, we reach them back. Inhale, reach, little back extension. Exhale, rise, we squeeze that butt. So really drive through this front heel. You might get a bit of a stretch through that back hip. That might feel nice. And you just go down as far down as you can. Squeeze 
leave that butt to stand. Okay, we haul this next one down, tip forward, shoulders down, and we pulse. 10, 9, 8, 7, through this front heel. 5, 4, 3, we're going to stay down, guys. 2, hold, scooter. Exhale, bend. Inhale. Exhale. Good. Bend and press. We add the arms. Bend and reach. Bend and reach. Stay low and loaded through that front leg. All of our weight is in this front heel. Let's use our lower abs to bring that back knee in. And let's see if we can get a little bit lower. Pressing through this front leg. Big breath. Good. Bend and press. Stay nice and low. We're almost there, guys. Okay, last four. Three, two, one. Stand up, give your butt a little pat out. Okay, grab a drink if you need, guys. We've got some lateral lunges left on this leg before we change legs. So when you're ready, you still want that slider underneath your right foot. Your slider's going to be under your right toes. Stand with our feet about hip width apart, toes turned out slightly. We inhale, lateral lunge, and we exhale, rise feet above. Inhale, slide that right leg away. Exhale, we lift, press through left heel, squeeze. Make sure this heel is nice and high, so we're just on our tippy toes on the slider. So our foot is actually pretty light on that slider. Inhale, we lower, exhale, we rise. Now as we lower, tip your body forward. So I'll show you what that looks like. Lunge, tip forward, and then stand up, squeeze the butt. Lunge, tip, stand up, squeeze. We're going to go down into some pulses. Lunge it down, squeeze it up. Good, down three, two, one, and lift. Four more, down three, two, one, and lift. Another 15 seconds here. We go down for three. Add those arms up at a diagonal to make this harder. Squeeze that butt to stand. Down for three, two, one, and lift. Down for three, two, one, and lift. Let's hold this one down. So we're, I'm going to show you from the side. We go down into that skater. Bend and press. Good. To make this harder, you can reach your arms up at a diagonal. Biceps go around our ears back extension. And make sure that left hip, knee, and ankle is staying in one line. I know this exercise feels like it's going on forever, guys, but we're almost there. See if we can get a little lower on that standing leg. Keep breathing in and out. All right, give a little smack. And we are going to change legs. Grab another drink if you need. My legs are cooked. So now we have our right foot forward. So the slider is going to go on the left foot. Right foot forward, tuck that tail. Open the chest, roll the shoulders down. Inhale, we lunge. Exhale, we rise. Now, I apologize, guys. This is not my good side. I have a little bit of a bad knee, so I'm pretty wobbly on this side. Inhale, we lunge. Exhale, we rise. Squeeze the butt. Good. Add those arms. Reach forward. Squeeze. You can choose to keep your hands on your hips instead. Oh, almost fell over. Or you can choose to keep them reaching forward. Drive through that front heel to lift. Isn't it crazy how different both our sides are? This one is no good for me. Inhale, lower. Exhale, rise. We're going to add those pulses. Shoulders down and back. Three, two, one, and lift. Inhale, lower. Three, two, one and lift, squeeze that butt. Inhale, lower three, two, one and lift. Inhale, lower. keep that chest up. Try not to lean forward. Push through that heel, squeeze that butt. Halfway there, guys. Big press. I'm just going to show you what it looks like from the front. My leg is going back, about hip width apart. Good, squeeze that butt to stand. Almost there. Squeeze it up. Let's hold it down. We have 10, 9, 8, 7, 6. Bend that back knee. 4, 3, 2, and 1. Bring it 
All right, now we have our arrow lunges, guys. Remember this back leg stays nice and straight. We're high on those tippy toes. Roll those shoulders back. Inhale, we tip forward. Squeeze that butt. And front knee tracks that ankle. And exhale, we rise. Squeeze. Inhale, we hinge. And exhale, we rise. Squeeze. Keep those shoulders back and down. See how I'm tipping forward as I go down? That's going to really load up this front glute. Squeeze that butt to stand. Inhale, we tip. Exhale, drive through this heel. Good. Super light through those back toes. Make sure that front knee is tracking over our ankle. Pulling that belly button to our spine. Inhale, we lower. This one is such a good booty builder. Exhale, we rise, squeeze. Okay, we hold it down to pulse. Ten. Nine, eight, seven. You can choose to reach your arms forward to make it a little harder. Last three, two. We're going to hold it down. Start to scooter, bend and press. You can add those arms. So tuck those elbows in as you press out, reach. As you press out, reach. Good. Keep scooping those lower abs. Stay tipping forward. Good. Press out, reach. So we're really loading up through that right heel, just like we did on the other side. I'm going to show you what this looks like from the front. Make sure those hip bones are staying nice and square. And that leg is going directly behind us. A few more here, and then we've got those lateral lunges. And then we get to lie down, guys. So we're going to grab that down there. One more. Press. And give it a little smack. All right, it's time for those lateral lunges. So we can stay here. I'm going to come back so you can see me. Inhale, we lunge. Exhale, we rise. So remember that front knee, ankle, and hip stays in one line of that right leg. We squeeze that butt cheek to stand, and we lean forward. Inhale, we lean. Exhale, we rise. Add those arms. You can reach forward, and then reach back towards your hips. Adding a little back extension. This is really good for the posture. You can do this one. Down for our pulses next. So we go three, two, one, and rise. Down for three, two, one, and rise. Good, nice and low. I apologize if we are not 100% even with these pulses on both sides, guys. I'm also just trying to survive here. <laughs> All right, start to skater, bend and press. Exhale, kick, inhale, bend. Stay low and loaded through that front leg. See our eye gaze is down to the floor. And really squeeze through that butt as you push out, nice and slow. You can reach your arms forward here or have hands on the hips. Good, stay low. Last little bit standing. We have three, two, and one. Give your butt a little pat. Kick that slider away. Grab a drink if you need. We're done with those sliders, and we're going to come down into our mat. Okay, we're coming down onto the mat four point kneeling now. Hands under shoulders, knees under hips, and we're going to cat cow. Exhale, we curl the spine, look back to the knees. Inhale, arch the back, look up. Exhale, tuck the belly button up and in as we curl. Inhale, pull the chest through the arms, stick that booty in the air. Exhale, we curl, scoop. Inhale, we arch. We're going to find that halfway, so pull that belly button up. Draw those shoulders down. Let's flex our left foot. Donkey kicks. We exhale. Kick that leg up. Squeeze the butt. Inhale, we bend. So we're pressing that heel up to the sky. We're keeping that leg bent at 90 degrees. If it's not good for your wrist here, you can come down onto your elbows. I always feel it a little bit more in my butt when I'm on my elbows, so I kind of like it down here. I can get my leg a little bit higher. Exhale, we press, squeeze. Now we're trying to stamp that heel up to the sky. A couple more here before we pulse. Squeeze that butt cheek at the top. Okay, we have one more before we pulse. Exhale, squeeze, lift, lower, hold this one up, pulse. 15, 14, 13, 12. Make sure that foot is flexed. Press that heel to the sky. Squeeze that butt. I've lost count. I think we're at about seven. Good. Let's pull that belly to the spine, girls. Nice work. Almost there. We're going to hold that leg up for a hamstring curl. Last one. 
Hold it up, extend the leg, point the toe, and then flex and bend. Inhale, extend, point, exhale, flex and bend. Point, extend, flex and bend. So as you extend that leg and point your toes, really squeeze that booty. Flex and then kick your heel to your butt. Exhale. Exhale. Let's keep that leg lifted, ladies. Try not to let it drop. We're doing awesome. Stay strong through those shoulders. You can walk up onto your hands if you prefer or do this on the elbows. I like this one on the hands. Should be feeling a little bit of a fire in the back of that leg. We're going to go into those donkey kick pulses again with that flexed foot. Hold this one in and pulse. 15, 14, 13, 12. Squeeze, lift. 10, 9, 8. Stay lifted. Stay nice and high. Good. Last five, four, three, two, one. Bring it down. All right, give a little love tap. We're gonna lie on our side. We want this left leg on top. So lie on your right side. Bring your knees up in line with your hips. Your feet are to the front of the mat. Your top hip is nice and long. Your waist is engaged. We're gonna exhale, float this top leg up just to hip height, and then lower. So see how my foot is flexed? And that whole leg lifts as well. Now we don't wanna lift the knee too high or the foot too high here. So lift that whole leg up and then press it down. So imagine like we have a cup of coffee resting on top of that knee and we're trying not to spill it. Okay, we're gonna add a hamstring kick at the top. Two more, one, two, hold it up. Exhale, extend, inhale, bend. Exhale, extend, inhale, bend. So we're just hinging at that knee. Keep that foot flexed, squeeze your butt as you extend your leg. We keep that leg lifted in line with the hip Exhale, extend, inhale, bend. So as you extend the leg, you should feel that butt working. See if we can keep that leg nice and high. Doing awesome, ladies. Keep going here. Big breaths. We're going to hold that leg straight and pulse it. Squeeze that butt as we extend. Good. Couple more. Hold that leg straight. Pulse. Pulse. Pulse, good, squeeze, lift. Easy option, you can bend your knee like this. So knees in line with the hip again. We're in that 90 degree angle. Harder option, we have that straight leg. Cool. our butt should be cooked. We have a couple more exercises to go, ladies. Give that butt a little love tap. Now we have our leg sweeps next. So extend the leg and point the toes. Bottom leg just stays hanging out. Inhale, sweep forward. Exhale, flex back. Inhale, point forward. Exhale, flex back. So this leg stays in line with the hip the whole time. Inhale, point. Exhale, flex. Now this one's still really going to work your butt, but it's going to feel nice because it's pretty lengthening as well. Now make sure that top waist stays nice and long. We're not moving through the torso. We're literally only moving through this leg. Keep that leg nice and lifted. Inhale, we wave forward. Exhale, flex back. Couple more here. We're going to bring that foot halfway forward for some internal rotation, lowers and lifts. And that is going to finish off this side of the booty. And then we're going to change sides. Bring that foot just in front of your mat. Turn your toes down. Inhale, we lower the leg. Exhale, lift. So these are our internal rotation lifts. Now make sure you're sticking your booty out behind you. So if we had a tail, We'd be sticking it out, not tucking it between our legs. That's really important to work the butt here. Exhale, we lift. Are we still drawing nice and flat across those hips? We're going to go into little pulses next. Squeeze and lift. All right, little pulse. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Give it a little pat out, a little love tap. And we change sides. We're going to come four point kneeling. So hands under shoulders, knees under hips. Let's cat cow again. Exhale, curl that spine, scoop that belly, look back to our knees, stretch the back. Inhale, lift the booty, lift the chest, look up. Exhale, tuck under, scoop. Inhale, arch the back, look up. Exhale, tuck and scoop. Inhale, arch, look up. Okay, find that neutral spine, flex that right foot, exhale, we kick, 
inhale we lower so think of it like a hinge just hinge up and hinge down if only it was that easy right <laughs> squeeze that butt at the top you can come down to your elbows if you prefer I find this better on my arms but a little bit more intense on my butt keep pulling that belly button to the spine and go nice and slow so we're squeezing that booty at the top stamping that heel to the ceiling Imagine like there's a spider on the ceiling. You're trying to smoosh it with that heel. Exhale, we lift. A few more here. We got those pulses coming up. Squeeze and lift. Three more for you. Two. Hold this next one up to pulse. 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 Nice and slow. Squeeze and lift. There we got about 10 more to go. Exhale, press that heel up. Last ones here, a few more. Stay strong, keep that leg nice and lifted. You're doing good, we're almost there. We're gonna hold that leg up and extend it out. You can stay on your elbows or come to your hands. Extend that leg, point the toes, and flex, kick. Inhale, point. Exhale, flex, kick. Inhale, point. Exhale, flex, kick, squeeze, point, reach. Flex, kick, reach your tippy toe long, and then squeeze. Can we keep that leg lifted? Squeeze. We've got those donkey pulses again. Good. This one is so good for those hamstrings. Hopefully you feel those hamstrings on fire down the back of our thigh. Exhale, we squeeze. All right, almost there to those pulses. Exhale, squeeze. Inhale, reach, squeeze that butt. Exhale, squeeze, inhale, point. Hold it and pulse, pulse, pulse. Squeeze, lift, squeeze, lift, squeeze, lift. Good, nice and controlled. Keep engaging through those abs. Let's try to stay strong through those shoulders. We get to lie on our side after this and that's how we're gonna finish. Tuck that knee in, give a little wiggle if you need. Come on to that side so you need your right leg on top. We're starting with those parallel clamps, knees in line with the hips, feet to the front of the mat, waist engaged, and we're going to flex the feet, exhale, lift top leg, inhale, lower. So remember we're lifting that whole leg like it's one. Now this is a small movement, we just lift to hip height. You're not going to open to the sky, that's not going to isolate the muscles we want to isolate, so we just go hip height. Lower. You can take your top hand on your hip, and if you do feel any movement under that hand, you've probably lifted it too long, too high. Let's pull that belly to the spine. We're going to add those kick outs. Just keep that bottom leg nice and tucked. My bottom leg is burning here. <laughs> Squeeze that butt to lift. Brace those abs. All right, kick and bend. So we hold that leg up. Exhale, extend. Inhale, bend. Keep that leg lifted the whole time. Keep bracing through those abs. Exhale, extend, inhale, bend. So we go straight leg and then 90 degrees. Straight leg and then 90 degrees. Remember we finish with those pulses. Your easier option is to have your leg at 90 degrees. Your hard option is to have your leg straight. Exhale, we extend, inhale, we bend. Last ones. We're gonna pulse this leg up. Breathe. Good. Keep it lifted. Hold that leg out straight. Easy option bend and pulse. 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 Make sure we're sticking that tail out behind us. Good. Give your butt a little love tap, a little pinch if you need. This is really working into those deep butt muscles. All right. We add that sweep. Inhale, point forward. Exhale, flex, sweep back. Inhale, we point. Should feel nice and stretchy this one. Exhale, we flex. Inhale, kick forward. Keep that bottom leg still. Keep that waist still. So like a lot of Pilates exercises, this exercise is about what's moving, but it's also about what's staying still and not moving as well. So waist is engaged. Core is still working here. We've got those internal rotation lifts and lowers to go. Let's do a few more big sweeps. These feel really nice on your hips. Hopefully, not so nice on the butt, but really nice on the hip. Bring that leg forward, turn your toes down, bring your foot just in front of your mat, and lower and lift. 
keep reaching that tailbone behind us. We should be tapping the floor just a couple inches in front of our mat. Squeeze that butt to lift. So toes are just kind of like floppy. So we've got like a floppy foot here. Exhale, lift, inhale, lower. A few more here before we pulse. And then we are going to stretch this booty out. Good little pulses. Eight, seven, six, five, four. Give a little pat if you need. Last one. Squeeze, lift, and then give a little snap. Okay, we're coming to a figure four stretch now. So let's start with our left leg. Come on to hands and knees and then bring your left leg forward. Flex your foot and try to get your shin as parallel as you can to the front of the mat. Push your right hip down into your heel and then come down onto your elbows if that feels good. If that's a little bit too much, you can stay on your hands. Our glutes are gonna be quite tender because we have just absolutely annihilated them. So don't worry if it feels really tight, that's totally normal. And if you need to take any of these stretches for a bit longer, you can totally hang out for a few more minutes and stretch for a little bit longer. Big breaths, relax with the shoulders. And let's change legs. Step that leg back, bring right leg forward. Now this one's probably gonna be tighter because we have just worked it. You can come down to your elbows if that feels good. You can kind of rock side to side if that feels good. Again, I like to kind of move in my stretches, but maybe you're more patient than me. <laughs> Breathe. We're going to stretch out our hips after this to finish. But again, if you need more stretches, take more. Couple more breaths. All right, coming up, let's take a hip stretch. Take the bottoms of the feet together, knees wide into a froggy position. Grab onto those feet and then fold forward. Lift that chest up and fold. Make sure you don't have a round spine. You can push your knees out. You can rock side to side. Wow, I am really impatient, aren't I? <laughs> Big breaths, open through the hips. And we are all done. Awesome work, girlfriend. That was really hard. I am going to feel that in my legs tomorrow. I hope you are as well. If you need time for more stretches, feel free to take it. Otherwise, thank you for joining me.